It's uh, June 16th, 2019, 7.18 a.m. And episode 510. So this is one of the ideas that I threw at CNN and that they picked over. And along with the last one I did. So um, we did like 15 ideas this week. So they couldn't pick them all. Yeah, but I, I really liked this. And I had the idea for a few days. And this is not one of the ones I thought they, that they would use at all. So... And I've been meaning to do something on, on Nixon with a John Dean testimony. And so that yesterday was a good time to do it. I got a really late start because we slept in and started the cartoon. And Amanda was, was really, really, really needing some Vietnamese soup. So we went to get some pho. And so then I came back and did the cartoon and finished it up. And I thought at that point not to really worry about what time of the day that we published it. Because, I mean, it was a Saturday. The editors probably don't really care uh, what, when they get it. Nobody's in the office, hardly anyone, except my CNN editor. And then, um, uh, and also on social media, I just think, you know, it's not going to be, if, if it doesn't go in the morning, it's not going to be that huge um, for the, you know, with getting shares and stuff like that. So I didn't really worry about that stuff. But then, after I published it around like five, um, let me look. It got about four, nearly 400 shares so far. And the website got like a gazillion trading hits. A lot of people like this cartoon. And this one, wee. <laughs> okay, this is a short video. Um, reason this is a very short video is because uh, most of this cartoon was lettering and I did not film that. So. I'm not real, really in love with this Nixon, but I figured for a smallish size drawing that it was okay because people will know who it is. Yeah, he does look kind of like a big ball sack. Someone on Instagram pointed that out. This cartoon really, really pissed off the conservatives on Instagram. Uh, last time I looked, there was like a bunch, a bunch, a bunch. I'm, sorry, I'm not giving you an official number here, a bunch, a bunch of comments, but it wasn't just how many comments there were. It was just like the anger. The anger. <sighs> I tell you. So, all right, let's do some comments. We only got a couple minutes. Ariel was talking about um, Amanda's cold, and um, well, she has. I did not give to her, so but she might have given it to me. Was but I'll find out in like a week or so. Um, sounds pretty bad, right? Yeah, she might have strapped. Oh no! But she's going out of town today, and I'm gonna be like moping around her house for, for like half a day or like a day and a half, something like that. If I go home. Um, and Arrow starting to learn to tell where I am and that I need to bring a guitar with me. I'm the only one here. I'm just afraid someone might beat it up. Not Amanda. And Arrow also loves Sarah's Wicked, which sucks. Straight sucks. But yeah, they're in this, the next cartoon coming up too for CNN. Um, so, and TJ's still on about, um, says that none of what I said was since right. So if one pays for foreign intel on their political opponent, it's A-OK. -okay. But if foreigners try to give you intel on your plural opponent, um, yeah, I, 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 right here the problem, TJ, is that your rationalizing, the, your reasoning, your rationalizing, and, and your reasoning, sorry, dude, it's early, it's like 722, I, I just started my coffee, but your reasoning is the problem here, your logic is the problem. Um, the law says, this is the law, not my opinion, the law says that you can pay for pay for uh, opposition research. Someone comes in and gives you opposition research. That is a contribution. Illegally, you cannot take a contribution from a foreigner. And now you're also stuck. That's, that's the law, okay? That's the law. That's not my opinion. That's not your opinion. That's not Errol's opinion or Robert Cortino's opinion. That is the law. Now, the other thing is, there's going up on the roof. Um, you keep saying that, they, that Hillary Clinton took foreign intel. She paid an American firm. So just throw that crap out the window. I know it's your talking point, but you might as well just go ahead and give it up because it's just, it's not a basis of any facts. It's basis for screaming, you know, and deflection, but it's not based on any facts with the law, okay? Because there's nothing illegal about that. All right, now that, that I've schooled you, it's time to go home. Um, <laughs> You guys have a great rest of the day. Uh, click the red button, subscribe, and say, give a comment. I'll give you a shout out. Talk to you later. Goodbye.